Yes. Good morning guys, welcome to the vlog. Today is August the 19th. Um, we should also take a second to recognize the fact that I actually know what day it is for the first time in a really long time. <laughs> it is Monday and it is about 7 a.m. I've been up since about 6.20, 6.30ish. Um, I've done my devotions and I'm getting ready to get a start on my day. This week is the first full week of my freshman year of college and I wanted to bring you guys along with me. I want to be able to remember it. I want you guys to see what I was up to and yeah, I don't have number three. I was doing dual enrollment at a different college last year for my senior year of high school and then I ended up transferring colleges um, just because they have a better culinary program and um, I would be able to be involved in volleyball and stuff like that. So I am going to community college in Raleigh now. Um, I am double majoring. I am doing baking and pastry arts and culinary arts. Um, I'm also a manager of the women's volleyball team, which is so fun. I'm able to practice with them. I'm able to just pretty much have all the experiences of being on the team without wearing the jersey. We have a crazy busy week this week. We have at least two away games this week, I think. We have practice every day. Um, it's gonna be a crazy busy week. Culinary classes are super, super long and not great hours. Um, so you guys will just see all of what my week is like and what a typical week for me will look like. Film my first day of class too. It was only English class. Um, but I that video should already be up. I'll leave that linked up here. <laughs> So the life of a double major and a student athlete-ish. I mean, I'm counted as a student athlete because I'm a manager. So I have to take three backpacks to school pretty much every day. Yeah, I, um, how am I supposed to do this? One, two, three. Here we go. Okay, kind of stressed because my mom wanted pictures like every mother does on the first day of school. And, um, I'm leaving late. I'll update you when I get there. seven hour class got out an hour and a half early so I get to go to practice and uh, practice the whole time. I'm excited. Let's go. Time to switch backpacks. Feels so good. deal with every day all right all the bags are done for the day ah my feet are soaked because I forgot my Crocs it's currently 5 11 and we got done with practice um, 
Now I'm gonna go home. I'm starving on break in class. I ate some cashews and a protein bar from Arbonne, but that's the only thing I've eaten today. I'm so hungry, and then we had two hour practice. I have to go get gas. Oh, and I don't have shoes. I'm gonna have to do it barefoot. Barefoot. taking a shower my face is clean and moisturized and then um, I'm in my pajamas and it's seven o'clock it's a good time if you're from the south you know that the only thing to go on a biscuit is a nice slice of tomato you know what I'm saying packing my bags for tomorrow I will see you guys tomorrow crazy bright and early um good night happy Tuesday it's so early um, the sun isn't even awake, so I don't think I should be either. I have no empty hands. It's 7.44 and I'm about to turn into campus and all I want to do is go home and go back to bed. Uh, what I started to say is Ooh. Ooh, look at that. Let's try it out. Let's try it. That's really good bread. <laughs> hey, hey, we gonna get some food. I drove from my school to her school to see her. And get food. And get food. Because food's a priority. Hello there. Hello. We got our food. Got what do you feel like? put in a solid 13 weeks of school. It's been four days. We're not doing well. And um, he's only been in school for two days. I've been in school for four days. We're not doing so great. Um, just wanna let you know. Um, yep. Now we're gonna go to Target to kill some time. I we, just we, want air condition. We're gonna all. make it. They have snickerdoodle oat milk creamer. Oh my word. Can you not? So we come into Target just to cool off from the hot weather outside and um. I'm sorry. It's a little potato company. They're so cute. It's a microwave, it's a microwave meal with a seasoning pack. This is genius. Whoever created this, I wanna hug them. And all I want to do is take a nap. Let's go. My practice is over. It's 6.20. I'm on the way home. I'm so exhausted. Practice was good, but our setter, Bree, who is incredible, um, she fell and sprained her ankle. And our other setter, Maddie, we had a scrimmage last week as they were warming up. Maddie fell and sprained her ankle and tore two to three tendons in her leg. Is it tendons or ligaments? So I'm gonna drive home now. Well, okay, excuse you. It's 7.43, I am home. Uh, I just got out of the shower and I'm getting ready to eat supper. It's so good. And good night, I'll see you guys tomorrow.
because we have church at seven. So Wednesdays are crazy long days. All of every day that I have is a crazy long day, but uh, that's what today looks like. So this morning I had to make sure that I grabbed stuff for practice and for church. So um, that kind of added a lot of stuff. I'm on the way to my dad's office. Woohoo! Now we're on the way to my dad's office. We going to Sprouts. We getting that five dollar sushi. You know what I'm saying, Dad? It's currently 6:59. I'm on the way to church. Um, practice went really well. Look how nasty that looks. Are you ready to see the coolest thing ever? I just thought that this was really cool, and I had never seen a slow mo video as cool as this. So, um, you're welcome. Is it mom gonna freak out when she sees the video that I got? Wow, that's gorgeous. Wow. I lost my mind. <laughs> Who filmed that? <laughs> Me. You? Yeah. See my unmade badge. Don't tell anyone. I will see you guys tomorrow to carry on this vlog. Good night. That wasn't staged at all. But good morning. It is Thursday. I'm going to the campus that's the farthest away from me today. Um, so today is my hybrid English class day. And to, wow, you can't, wow, all, mm, this is awesome. So we have a game tonight. We have our first conference game. And we also don't have either of our setters. So um, one of our right sides, Jess, is going to be setting. We have a team supper at Panera at 5. Um, so I just decided to stay in Raleigh. Currently 9 o'clock. I just got here. I have a 9.30 class. So I'm going to make myself a fizz. I think I've talked about Arbonne a little bit. It's like a health and wellness brand. Love them so much. Um, and honestly, Caffeine, I've talked about it some before, caffeine really, really, really makes me feel awful and I can't drink caffeinated coffee because it makes me sick. It's not a fun time. Your girl still needs caffeine because she's crazy busy and she's on the go all the time. So Arbonne has these things called fizz sticks and they have um, natural caffeine in them from green tea and they're naturally sweetened. So there's not like added weird wonky sugars and artificial mess. So, I'm gonna do one of those, um, the citrus flavor, and then I'm using my Mind Health from them, cause goodness knows this girl can use some Mind Health. This one's cherry lime flavor. And you must think like, oh, that's kinda weird to put them together. No, it's amazing. It's currently 11 o'clock, and I got out of class early. We got out about 10 minutes early maybe a, like seven if we want to be technical. I drove all the way to downtown Wake Forest. It's a coffee shop that I've been wanting to go to for the longest time called Black and White Coffee Roasters. Coffee review time, here we go. I got a decaf oat milk latte and I'm excited. I didn't get any flavorings, nothing to mess up the flavor of the espresso okay are we ready ordered and he pulled the shot for the decaf and he was like oh it went too long I'm gonna repull it that is a good barista he knows how long the shot is supposed to pull for and if it comes out longer it's gonna be a watery shot and it's not gonna taste good so he repulled it yes how hard it is to find a good smooth coffee in North Carolina everything is so nutty everything is so toasty this is smooth this is good thanks 
go to our team supper at Panera. So, um, I have about a 38 minute drive from where I am right now. It's crazy how big Raleigh is. Anyway, traffic was literally the craziest it's ever been, um, ever. So I'm finally here at Panera. Let's go. I'm late. Hey, this one's like he's bald. No, it's so funny. And then he has like weird. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! In. Swing. Good morning. It's Friday. First grade. Ever since the first day of school, since first grade, mom has always made these muffins called donut muffins. I don't ever. There's a story behind why they're called donut muffins. I'm not gonna read it to you. They're just good. Y'all dip it in the butter. Let it sit for a bit. Okay. I dunk it in the powdered sugar. I usually let it sit because I like it real, real full of powdered sugar. It's 149. I'm on the way to school and I'm almost there, thankfully. Um, today we have an away game. So all morning I was just working on homework. I cleaned my room a little bit. Um, I made my bed for the first time in over a week. We have to drive three hours. We're going to Mid-Atlantic Christian University, which is in Elizabeth City, North Carolina, which is close to the beach. American people, okay? I don't be carrying around in big Oh, no, he doesn't know how to work the bus. <laughs> I feel super safe. <laughs> no, right? Should we trust this? <laughs> Are you having trouble, sweetie? Can't they just shove the door open from the inside? Right? Hello. Hey, cat. They're excited. It's currently 12.35 in the morning and I just got home. Um, that is a typical week in my life. I am so exhausted. Yeah, I'm going to bed. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I did this week. It was a crazy long week. I'm so tired. I just want a weekend where I can sleep and not do anything, but tomorrow I'm back at it. I have to leave here at 6.45, which means I need to probably wake up around 5.30. So that means I'll probably get like four and a half hours of sleep. We love that. Okay, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. If you made it through this video, you are the real MVP. You're the real OG cat crew. We love it. But go down and hit that red subscribe button and ding the bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Good night.